It's an exciting time in Night City. The metro system is open. I'm here at Memorial Park. We are at the NCART terminal. I have my metro pass. And you and I are going to take a trip through Night City. I wanted to make this earlier in the week, but it's been a bit of a busy week, uh, especially if you're a Fortnite player. Me and my squad have been putting a lot of hours into that game, but we're not talking about video games today. Talk about the Metro Night City. Because I still do have a real life, you know? So here we go. Oh, train's coming. 45 seconds. So, let's go into here. By the way, end cart. The Night City Area Rapid Transit. And, as you can see, we have four routes we can choose from today at this terminal. Santi, Santo Domingo to Watson, Watson to Santo Domingo, City Center to Pacifica, and a round trip Westbrook through Haywood. Now, that's a fun one if you want to maybe stall going to home. You're not ready to go home, you're listening to a good podcast. You know, just loop around. But we're going to go with C, which is city center to, I know, Pacifica. Ooh. It's so funny. You know, I've been here three years. They've warned you about Pacifica, but it's honestly no worse than Japantown and anywhere that night city is night city doesn't matter where you are in it so here it is it's funny the things we get excited for huh as someone who walks a lot in this city drives occasionally it's nice to have another option I know I'm not the only one that's been waiting for the system to come into place so yeah people are excited here that's for sure I like that doesn't take too long, which is what you want, right? You want to be able to get to where you're going fast and efficient. I like that it's only been open for a week. And if you just look around, it's very much Night City. Trash and people people and trash but not everyone here is trash by the way like I've said in countless other videos there's a lot more good people out here than there are bad but that's not gonna sell you a newspaper so you don't really get to see the everyday day-to-day -day cool people you know But yeah, uh, oddly enough, too, ever since Tuesday, which is when this train system, metro system, opened up, I also have noticed that my reinforced tendons make a louder noise when I use them. And that might seem weird, like, okay, your ASMR friend, what is that? 
what do those two things have to do with each other? You know, I don't know. A cosmic sort of connection. I mean, we get this opening. Maybe I'm just crazy. Maybe I'm just hearing it. But it sounds like it's louder when I use my reinforced tendons, a.k.a. my double jump. It's life in Night City. What, what can I do? Next stop, Pacifica Stadium. All right. We have the next stop, Pacifica Stadium. Now, obviously, that stadium is not active, not up and running. There's not a sports game going on there. But yeah, what I like about it is you can just lay back and take in the scenery. Final stop. Please disembark. Ooh. That looks painful, buddy. Oh man, some great tunes. I also don't know if you heard... <laughs> yep. Screams of people in the distance. Yep, running away. I don't know if you can hear them, but there are gunshots. Well, Pacifica is still Pacifica. I'm just gonna run over here. Oh, did you see that light fall down? Oh yeah, okay. Uh, I should warn you, distressing images. I will turn that away now. And, uh, I mean, that was it, you know. I don't have much more to show you about the metro system. It's open, it's working, we're all excited, and I'm just gonna, just gonna borrow this car. Oh, okay. Gotta be careful. Oh my gosh. Well, I don't have insurance, so. Slow down, slow down. People are crazy in this city, I tell you. Oh, where are you going? That's so important. <laughs> oh my, he just hit him. That's so rude. But yeah, uh, what an exciting year. Also, Dogtown. Went to Dogtown for the first time after living here for three years. And, uh, some exciting stuff. I mean, when in Rome, right? Right. Drive casual. Don't look like you're driving casual. That's normal. They're going to scan. so jumpy sometimes, I swear. And look at that. Now I know it's maybe not the, the paradise that was promised from the developers of this place, but I gotta say, Dogtown has its own, own vibe. And you're either with it or you're not, and I dig it. I'm cool with it. But I understand maybe it's not for everyone. But I do certainly enjoy it. 
But yeah, now that we have Dogtown, we have the metro system, we just have all these new ways to enjoy our city. Feels cool that I say our city, because now this place is really starting to feel more like home. I'm not just a visitor. I live here. Of course, I've made countless videos of my adventures, my tours in here, some talking, some not. I'll leave links for those playlists down below. Of course I will. I'm your ASMR friend, I'll do that for you. So yeah, if you are interested, I have a video where I walk through that stadium, the one you're looking at right now. I don't talk through it, but that way you get to experience city life for yourself. And you don't have to go anywhere. You don't have to face any danger, any risk of bodily harm or getting robbed. It's a safe place and a safe way to explore the stadium. Getting close to sunset. This city never really goes to bed. No one stops to take a rest. There's a lot of energy in the city, and at nighttime, it can get pretty crazy. And I tell you, if you need anything you could think of, it's at the stadium. Cyberware, weapons, clothing, food, ingredients you can't get anywhere else in Night City. You have to at least visit here. And if you're not comfortable going by yourself, if I'm in town while you're in town here, if I'm free, hit me up. I'll join you for a walk around. Or if you have a couple friends, safety in numbers. And like I said, though, there's risk of danger anywhere you go. You could slip and fall walking down the stairs of your house. But I get it. I'm someone who lives with anxiety as well. It's always good when you get there. It's the preparation just have to get up, get out, and get there. So, go at your own pace. Don't rush yourself. Don't force yourself to do something you're not comfortable with. But do challenge yourself. Step out of your comfort zone. Because... The risk is worth the reward. And the experience 
it's definitely worth it. I think that even if you don't have a great night, unless you're really not digging it, unless it's all off for you, I, I think you'll find something here you like. Honestly, come here, grab something to eat, do a quick walk around, in and out. Do it at 2 p.m. You'll be fine. Trust me. I am your ASMR friend after all. But just take a look around. It's awesome, right? Now. Like I said. I'll go with you if you if you want. So, I'll see you around.